Good morning. Welcome to Ozarks Fox AM on this fantastic fry. Yay! Guess where we are? We're at Lucas Oil Speedway with our good friend Danny Lorton. Danny, it is so good to see you, my friend. Yeah, thanks for coming. It's Glad always better to see you in person than on Zoom, you know. Oh, yeah, it's a lot better. You look so much better in person. <laughs> <Thank> <laughs> Danny, thank you so much for inviting us out here. Now, today is something very special. We're doing some drag boat racing, and you actually moved up the time so our viewers can see the boats in action. Thank you for doing that. Yeah, no problem. Like I say, normally we don't start till 9, but it's like get the show, kind of get the locals to kind of see what we got going on here. So the best way to do it would be live action. And you know, every time we're here, we're always like, man, we want to see those boats. And go. now we get to see them. Yep, and we're starting with the best first. Yes, and so here's Lake Lucas right here, right behind us. Yes, it is. And this is where all the action is going to happen. This is it. So where, tell us how it kind of works. Where do the boats come in? Where do they do? What's the order? Okay. Uh, well, normally, like I said, today we're going to start. Normally we go slower to faster, but today we're going to go fast to slow okay. since you're all here. Thank but you. The, the drivers will come down what we call parade lane. They'll come down from the grandstands here in this gravel road. They'll go up to the corner for staging, and then they'll enter the boats over here where the flag is. That's where they put the boats okay, in the water, yeah, yeah. and they got ropes up there that they hold on to to get in. Oh, wow. Then now, then pass this way. what kind of speeds are we talking about here? The top alcohol, I think the record right now is 210. 210. Yes. On that water. Yes, it is. Right there. And I heard talking to him last night, he's wanting to break the teens, so <gasps> that's oh, what his goal wait, is. Wait, let's bring in Barry. Now, tell us, Barry, come on in here, Barry. Now, who, who is this, this tall, Barry strapping Sal young lad uh, right here? Barry Salzman. He's the uh, head of Kentucky Drag Boat Association. He's the one that runs it. So, tell us what's going on. Now, are you the man in charge then? I'm supposed to be, yes. I am the person in charge. <laughs> okay, so when they're racing, how long is this uh, Lucas, uh, Lake Lucas? How long does it go, and how fast are these people going to get from one end to the other? Uh, the track's 1,000 foot. Uh, they're going to cover it in a little bit better than four seconds, like four and a quarter seconds, the fast ones are. The ones he's talking about running 210 mile an hour. So let me ask you, if I blink, am I going to miss it? No, it'll get your attention. You oh, won't break. No. Now I'm hearing somebody rev up engines right now. Is it is it a pretty loud event? Did you hear like the engines going? Yeah, you'll hear a lot of noise. Uh, of course, the faster they go, the more the more noise they're going to make. Uh, you know, it's uh, it kind of goes the faster you go, the louder it gets. Right. What are the different categories of uh, boats, drag boats racing today? Uh, today we have everything from. Uh, entry level personal watercraft classes all the way up to top alcohol hydro running 200 plus mile an hour. Oh, wow. So there's a little bit of everything for everybody. Uh, you know, it's uh, broke down into second indexes, um, you know, starting nine, eight, seven, six, five, sixty. And on down. So today, starting at 8 o'clock, they're going to be qualifying for what's coming up this weekend. Is this the pre-qualifier? Yeah, they'll be qualifying today and tomorrow, and they'll take that qualifying order, and they will turn it into a pairing ladder, which we will race off of for eliminations on Sunday. So it starts today and it ends on Sunday? It starts today and Sunday afternoon. Two days qualifying, Sunday's eliminations. I'm curious, too, what, what are people winning here? What's the, what's the grand prize? What are you trying to get? We're running... Total purse for everything is about thirty some thirty thirty thousand dollars. That ain't nothing to laugh at, Danny. Are you paying that out of your pocket, Danny? Uh, I help pay some of it. Yes. You do. <laughs> Danny's got the deep pockets right here. Danny's got deep pockets. Are, so is, are you looking forward to this today? Is this something you look forward to? Oh yeah, yeah. Like I said we have four events with them every year. We look forward. This especially this one here. This is our Diamond National. This is usually the biggest event we always have. Mm -hmm. uh, hopefully we do have over 100 boats, which we normally have for this event. So we should be a good good show. 13 when we shut down last night. Yeah, you know, there was 113 done register when we closed last night. And I'm curious too, Danny, when I was pulling in, I see all of these. Are these the racers? I see the big trucks, the campers. People are camping out here ready for today. Is that is that part of the campgrounds or is that all the uh, oh, people racing? Yeah. What you're seeing here, that's all the part of the racers themselves, the crew members and drivers. Well, what's fun is coming up in the show, we're going to get to go to all of these trailers, interview some of the people who are going to be racing here in about an hour. And I heard a lot of them bring their dogs, they bring their families. It's, it's a huge family yeah, event. That's yeah, all it is, all about family. And can people still come down and get tickets to sit in the grandstands and watch? Yes, they can. Uh, ticket booth open at 8 o'clock. 8 o'clock, guys. Come on down. We're going to be here for the entire show. Now,